They are largely designed to make Kenya a client state, to put Kenya on its feet so that we can keep on depending, moving around with a beggar's ball. Production in Kenya has become too expensive. So everything is going to shrink, the economy is going to collapse, and we shall begin begging all over the world. And we shall be a perfect client state for the West. So William Root, I think, is empty. This head is empty in terms of a, what are the ex existential threats that face the black people, that face Africans. He swallowed the issues of the white man, the way they are packaged. He doesn't understand uh, chronic capitalism, how it works. So he has now become an agent of the West to destroy an African state. And some of the things he does is doing are bordering on prison. That prisonable and maybe going down the line he might be impeached. If he doesn't change course and begin understanding what Article 1 says, that the people of Kenya are sovereign. And when they elected him, there was no way in his manifesto where he said that the IMF and the World Bank are going to govern Kenya when he gets into office. He promised to govern this country. But he is destroying it. Everything is crumbling in one year. It's not acceptable. So he needs to shape up or, or he might get impeached down the line. I don't think his own peace will die with him. They are going to get a point whereby he can be impeached if he doesn't change course and begin doing things that benefit this country, not, not to benefit the Western powers, not to benefit the World Bank. Right now he wants to sell the assets. These assets, were, some of them were put up before he was born. Now he wants to come and sell them. What will the future gener generations have as a state? Those who run the government in the future, what will they rely on to run this government? I would have to, we have already talked of food. We are talking of transport. We are talking of uh, education. We are talking of health. If these things are sold, how, how will the future governments find out those key ingredients of a modern society? So for me, I think William Ruto is going overboard. And where we are right now, we might be facing an impeachment very soon. My name is John Odero from Kenya Digital News. I just have one question for you to shed more light on. Recently, we had the bipartisan talk report being uh, tabled by, uh, by the human